as a Yankee fan, I not only see, I engage with most of the preseason negativity about the Yankees pitching staff. Even entering the playoffs, a lot of complaining is done about the Yankees pitching, myself included. However, with the exception of Garrett Cole's start in 2021 in October, the Yankees pitching going back to 2019 in October has been nothing short of elite. It's the offense that does not show up, and believe it or not, it's the same story this year. Just look at these numbers. Aaron Judge, 179, 12 strikeouts. Torres, 148. Stanton, 167. Oswaldo Cabrera is batting 091. But that's not his fault. He's a rookie. The postseason is not supposed to be on his shoulders. Donaldson, who's one of my least favorite Yankees, believe it or not, is batting 227, which is like batting 350 right now compared to the rest. Matt Carpenter, 0 for 7, 7 strikeouts. No offense. Zero. Zilch. Not only is the Yankees pitching right now top tier, their defense is playing at a level I haven't seen in a while. I know I'm a Yankee fan. However, I truly believe if the Yankees can win Game 3, they can win the series. If they lose Game 3, well, history really isn't on their side on that one. With that said, just watch some of these incredible plays that they have put together so far. Hit on the ground to short. Diving stop, Peraza throws to first. In time, beautiful play. Plays ever made it in postseason. There he is. That's terrific. Gets it, gets down, turns around, and a one hot throws it. Around in July. That's a broken bat up the middle. Got to hurry here. And Peraza throws on the run. A dig by Rizzo. What a play. A line shot. Oh, oh what a pick. Flip to the bag. Throw to first. Another oh. pick. Oh. City Torres, a sensational play. Then he throws one in the dirt, and the Gold Glover Rizzo saves yet another error. Oh my goodness! Aaron Judge with some closing speed. What a great play that was! Wow, I, I didn't think he had a chance at this.